Hey America, thanks for tuning in. We're keeping it real with the Days I Show. So the day topic, we're going to talk about how the government is pretty much making a lot of you men so feminine that you're becoming useless to us women. What you may think, I really don't give a fuck. I'm just letting you know. That's why I call it keeping it real with the Days I Show. Now, y'all men out there becoming so feminine, the reason why I say become useless, we can't breed with you niggas. Dig what I'm saying? And if everyone turns fucking all gay, all these men turn to transgender, how are we going to be able to breed? Did you ever think about that before you got your dick cut off? Hmm? Did you ever think about that? Did us bitches need men so we can breed for the next generation? Yeah. Then now all you're going to have is all the elite motherfuckers running around. Yeah, did you ever just sit back and think? Yeah, it's not wrong with being a man. Come on now. Reason why I say that is, if I was a man, I'd be dicking everything good down. Just throw a condom on. Dig what I'm saying? But then, I don't know, I guess it's what's in the water. Back in the day, see, sitting up at the club, me and my girls used to sit there, and it was like, all oh, ladies' night, all oh, shit, we get dressed up, we go out. And I noticed... All the men be hanging out in the same room with each other. Me and my girls used to be like, now we know we look good. What the fuck is going on? Didn't know that feminine shit was already getting in play. Y'all men was already over there dicking down and sucking each other's dick. And then want to get mad at us because we don't want to hook up with you. I'm not trying to be sucking on no dick that was some nigga ass. Sorry folks, that just ain't the way I go. Now how I say the government is doing this? Just sit back and think. Seriously. Just sit back and think, put that wine down, pull over, mm-hmm, turn the TV off. Just 10 years ago, everything was smooth. There was games going on, you know, that's violence, but still there was men being men. You know what I'm saying? You had niggas out here fist fighting, you know, thugging and shit, everything. You could tell the men from the bitches. Now all of a sudden, drinking the water, everybody's swaying the same way. Just think, why would the government be doing that? Because if we was invaded, motherfuckers, we'd be done. Because all the men that turned to bitches. Uh-huh. Just think, just listen to the news. And the military, now these men want to come out and be transgender. Matter of fact, they going in knowing that you can get transgender while you're in the military. What the fuck type of bullshit is that? I'll be mad as fuck my man went in and then come out looking better than me. See, we have a problem. People need to sit back and really think. The news is not all really oddity. It's reason why I say this, I get scared because in the time of war, all these transgender, they're going to be caring about their makeup in here. We need to be caring about blowing these motherfuckers up, showing how strong we are. Meanwhile, y'all go over there and then you come back all transgender up. Wanting to wear heels, thinking it's all cool, glamorous being a woman. People got things twisted up. Y'all need to stop listening to the news, thinking everything all glory. Do you know they puppets? I told you before they puppets. You go to one channel, and then the next channel, and then the next channel. They all have the same shit. They all go on a commercial at the same damn time. Yeah, the world could be blowing the fuck up. We could be having a meteor come to us right now. And you know what them puppet air makers going to say? Oh, yeah, this is a sunny day out. Mm-hmm. Go take your dogs out for a nice long walk. Sure. Meanwhile, they in their fucking bunker, and we about to get blown the fuck up out here. They got those green screens. You can't trust it. They have those green screens, so you don't even know where the fuck they be at. Have you even noticed when you looked at the TV, and they be all fucking up on the editing, and the lady sitting there talking about, yes, we're at a protesting, but meanwhile, you just see a car that looked like it should have hit her ass. Uh-huh. Yeah. Just think. That shit ain't always real all the time. It's not called conspiracy, motherfuckers. It's called reality. Just sit back and just take a look at shit real close. Mm -hmm. Don't believe everything you see and hear from the news people. They're not on our side. You better go outside and take a look for your damn self. YouTube is the best, I'm telling you. You better tune in for some more reality on that ass.